Sign up to the SBR Network and use your free daily bet points to earn real-world prizes. Click on the page and start winning now. Hi, and welcome to Where's the Action? I'm your host, Ross Benjamin. I will be previewing the second round game in the NCAA tournament in the Midwest region between the Wolford Terriers out of the Southern Conference and the Big Ten Michigan Wolverines. The game will take place at the Bradley Center in Milwaukee, Wisconsin on Thursday evening with the opening tip 7.10 p.m. Eastern Time. Currently, as we speak, the Michigan Wolverines are a 16-point favorite, and the total in this game is 126 and a half. Well, the Wolford Terriers finished tied for third in the Southern Conference regular season standings, and then they had everything fall their way in the Southern Conference tournament as they breezed through winning three games in three days and getting the automatic bid to the NCAA tournament. Now, this is a team, granted, they lost five games in their own conference during the regular season in the Southern Conference. In addition, they went three and seven in non-conference play this season, and their only win versus a Division I opponent in non-conference play was versus Gardner-Webb by a slim three-point margin. Now, on the positive side, this is a team that's very good defensively. They're 23rd in the nation, holding foes to 62 points a game. And the great equalizer in college basketball, as they say, is the three-point shot when it comes to an underdog staying in the game. Well, they shoot the three awfully well, referring to Wofford, as they are at 37% on the season. Folks, they're going to have to be just as good defensively in this game as their numbers indicate. And on the other hand, they're going to have to probably shoot better than 37% from the three-point range to even stay in this contest. This is a Michigan team that's one of the best three-point and field goal percentage teams in all the country. Michigan won the Big Ten regular season title. They advanced to the Big Ten Conference Tournament Final before losing to in-state rival Michigan State. And a, a very interesting story as it applies to this Michigan Wolverine team. Now remember, folks, this is a team that advanced to the NCAA Tournament Final last season before losing a close game to eventual national champion Louisville. They lost Mitch McGarry in the game at home versus Arizona earlier this season. McGarry is their star center. And that loss versus Arizona at home dropped the Wolverines record to 6-4 and four at that time. And it looked like things were just falling apart for Michigan and unraveling with the loss of McGarry, a substandard 6-4 and four record, and having to enter a very tough schedule in the Big Ten. Well, the Wolverines put all that to rest as they won 19 of their last 23 games and they entered the Midwest region as the number two seed. Now, as far as my selection goes in this contest, I'm going to lean on a NCAA betting total system. Anytime you have a team with a total of 120 to 129 and a half, and they're playing in a tournament game, whether it be the NCAA, NIT, CBI, or CIT, and both teams in the contest have a winning percentage of between 0 .600 to 0 .800. 30 of those 38 games, that's 79%, have gone under the total in the last five seasons. We're going to take the Wolford Terriers in the Michigan Wolverines under the total of 126 and a half on Thursday in the NCAA tournament. My name is Ross Benjamin. You've been watching Where's the Action? Thank you for joining me and have a fantastic day.